going on ladies and gentlemen, my name is Kevin Jekwitz, this is the Cage Review, and this is the Rock and Metal Review, and I gotta say to the Rock and Metal Review uh, fans, thank you so much, you guys have literally made this channel, uh, let me get that out first and foremost, like, between Ginger and Baby Metal alone, you guys are giving me more views than everything else combined, that's legit, so like, that's a dedicated fan base. And I appreciate it. I appreciate the hell out of it. I've always said that rock and metal, the community, is very close. It's tight-knit. And people look out for each other in that community. And they respect, you know, people's love of the music. Because it is... I don't want to say it's dead. It's not dead. But it's one of those things that it's not as popular as it used to be. You know, everything's very commercialized now. So I love that people can get into this music and share their love of it. With all that being said, this is Baby Metal. I wanted to come back to them. I actually tried to put this song on once. It was a combination of this and the one from a concert they did. And it got blocked. But it says that I can use this song uh, in the copyright suggestions. I checked it out. It says it's okay. So what I did was I had to get a compilation. And I know people are not necessarily a fan of compilations. But it is what it is. I have to work with what I have to work with. I am a huge fan of Baby Metal, and this is really the band that shot uh, my channel into any kind of notoriety, you know. Uh, I, I put this on, and I watched my views skyrocket. So, with that being said, uh, I did fall in love with the band. I think they're absolutely amazing. Um, I'm still getting to know the names of all the members of the band. I've got Bo the bassist, Mickey O, of course, who we all know passed away. Uh, I know... Sue Metal, Moa Metal, and um, Yui Metal. Of course, Yui not with the band anymore either. Um, so, but I am still kind of getting that process of learning everything, you know, learning the band members' names. Uh, there's a couple of guitarists I still am not familiar with, and I still don't know the drummer's name. And I actually think they have more than one drummer uh, in the God Band. But for Tales of Destinies, I heard this song and I was like, holy shit. Like, it is so good. And that's why I'm coming back to it, is because, like, if there's one song from Baby Metal that I have not reacted to that I really want to get on, it's this one. It really, like, blew me away. So, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to shut up. This is Baby Metal, Tales of the Destinies. I do like the lasers there. I'm a big fan of laser shows. That guitar work is so good. I love that change, dude. Completely different. They do have huge crowds, dude.
Oh yeah, it's strong, dude. That double bass is sick. I love that, dude. I love it. You literally just threw in a section of swing music into a metal song. Okay, so there's Mikio in the background doing his guitar solo thing. Dude, he was so sick. Somebody please tell me what that drummer's name is again. He's so damn good. This is complicated as hell. Absolutely amazing. Absolutely crazy amazing. Okay, so I've said before, one of the things I, I really super am glad about is that I found a band who is this technically sound. The starts, the stops, the changing rhythms on a dime. I mean, you literally have a song that's, okay, five minutes long and you're changing rhythms solid at least every 30 seconds, sometimes quicker than that. I mean, they even had a real quick swing breakdown in the middle. That is just talent. It, when I first heard this, it, it literally blew my mind away. Like, that they would construct a song this technically sound. I was so impressed with this. So, I'm hoping this goes through, and if it did, you'll be seeing it. <laughs> but... I wanted to share this because it is just so fucking talented. You don't get any better than this. You literally do not. I don't care what you say. I have heard bands around the fucking world that is amazingly talented. Like, the next level up is like the Steve Vai's and the Joe Satriani's of the world. So, that's my impression of it, man. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. I thoroughly enjoyed it. If you did, hit the like button, subscribe, and share. My name is Kevin Jackowitz, Cage Nation, out.